2018, the international scientific community was taken aback by claims from the South China Morning Post affirming that the nation had achieved an impressive breakthrough unlike anything the world had ever seen. While militaries the world over were struggling to harness the full potential of laser weapons, the article bluntly stated that China had managed to create a portable laser rifle, not unlike the ones in science fiction novels. With the capability to set fire to objects or enemies roughly a kilometer away, the ZKZM-500 laser gun would undoubtedly be an uncanny and revolutionary development. The source alleges that China has created a mighty weapon tuned to an invisible frequency that produces no noise whatsoever. As one researcher puts it, quote, nobody will know where the attack came from. It will look like an accident. Beyond Endurance. In July of 2018, the South China Morning Post published an article that drew the attention of several militaries, scientists, and enthusiasts around the world. The paper claimed that Chinese researchers of the Xi'an Institute of Optics and Precision Mechanics at the Chinese Academy of Sciences in Shanxi had finally brought, quote, Star Wars to life. The article referred to the ZKZM-500 laser gun, a weapon roughly the size and weight of an ordinary assault rifle, but capable of firing hundreds of shots. And according to the source behind the report, the laser assault rifle is classified as non-lethal and capable of instant carbonization of human skin and tissues. One researcher noted, quote, the pain will be beyond endurance. The 15mm caliber weapon is purported to produce an energy beam invisible to the naked eye that can pass through windows. Allegedly, the gun can also set fire to fuel tanks. In addition, the laser gun is said to be powered by a rechargeable lithium battery, not unlike the ones used in smartphones, but still capable of firing over a thousand two-second shots on a single charge. Even more impressively, it can supposedly ignite targets as far as a kilometer away. At about the size of a thermal US laser and weighing three kilograms, the ZKZM-500 is said to be an anti-personnel gun easily held by a single operator. And yet, the US version is merely capable of causing a sensation of extreme heat, a fact that has raised eyebrows among many experts in the field. Live Demonstration Laser weapons have appeared in science fiction media for decades, but outside a few niche applications, they have failed to live up to their fictional destructive potential in real life. Hence, when a Chinese company claimed to be at the cutting edge of such technological innovation, most experts and enthusiasts were highly suspicious. It is said that, physically speaking, a laser weapon with the specified characteristics would not be able to set fire to objects hundreds of meters away. But when the international community pointed out the impossibility of such a weapon existing today, the company behind the so-called Laser AK-47 responded with a demonstration video to appease skeptics. The video, posted on the South China Morning Post, dated July 4th, 2018, shows an operator firing a laser gun and setting fire to a wide range of objects tens of meters away. However, the footage did little to clarify most unanswered questions. And until the Chinese Academy of Sciences offers a real or live demonstration, the experts will not be satisfied. Bragging that 10 years ago such capabilities would have been reserved for sci-fi films, the article quoted a supposedly respectable yet anonymous laser weapon scientist describing how the innovative device is able to, quote, burn through clothes in a split second. If the fabric is flammable, the whole person will be set on fire. Reality Check Simply put, the weapon's description is absolutely incompatible with physics. Researchers in the field affirm there is no way the weapon described by the Chinese article can produce the amount of heat they claim, let alone a kilometer away. The actual size of lasers is significantly voluminous, and even the smaller ones need to be carried by truck. Moreover, their mobility is limited by their long, coiled optic fiber cables. The science behind such devices indicates that lasers lose power because of a phenomenon called attenuation, meaning that the beam scatters as it progresses, and thus its effect is notably weakened. During its trajectory, the laser comes through an amount of water and air that would sharply reduce its power to a mere fraction of its original strength, and a kilometer is a considerable distance. Laser Technology 
For many decades, and for different reasons, laser weaponry capable of actual harm has eluded the world's militaries as of the 2020s. First, there is the power. Lasers of relatively low power can indeed damage eyes, but it has more to do with the fact that the human eye is a delicate evolutionary marvel that is perhaps the most sensitive optical instrument on Earth. In other words, the inherent power of the laser has only a fraction to do with the actual damage, and the light that overloads the light-sensitive medium and wreaks havoc inside an eye is to blame. In contrast, the destruction of a physical body, ranging from a body part to a missile, would be caused by heat. Still, the article explains that the gun is supposedly powered by rechargeable lithium-ion batteries, and that it is capable of generating a thousand two-second shots, or about half an hour of sustained fire. Existing large-scale laser weapon systems have struggled to build up enough heat unless they are trained on targets for a few seconds, and they require a whole army of batteries. Airborne and vehicle systems can fire a single shot with a magnitude of tens of kilowatts, and even then, the weapons are incapable of causing severe damage. The power required to set a person aflame from half a mile is exceedingly large, and it's been deemed impossible that a portable lithium battery-powered rifle could produce the necessary amount of heat, even at point-blank range. Unlike bullets, lasers continuously scatter as they progress, and beyond a few dozen meters, attenuation becomes genuinely significant. By the time the beam reaches 800 meters, its power is rendered useless. It's likely that the Chinese laser gun would be incapable of popping a balloon at said distance. Politics There are indeed lasers that can fire from Earth to space and the other way around. However, they are not designed to fry an opponent. This type of laser simply emits intelligible signals that arrive at their given destination in the form of a few photons. That's not to say laser weapons will never exist. But right now, the announcement of a laser gun ready for mass production at $15,000 a piece to be used by China's anti-terrorist forces seems sketchy. At most, the ZKZ M500 is still a prototype under development and a concept to be perfected in the future. Moreover, it is said that the information behind the article could have been crafted to instill fear in the opposition, going as far as to mention illegal protests. A follow-up article by Business Insider Australia reads, quote, one Beijing police officer said he would prefer to stick to more traditional crowd control methods, such as tear gas, rubber bullets, or electrical stun guns, such as tasers. A laser burn would leave a permanent scar. He said it would be a horrid sight that risked causing panic or transforming a peaceful protest into a riot. After all, the only thing scarier than an invisible laser gun that can set someone on fire is the idea of getting shot by it. Thank you for watching Dark Tech. If you enjoy military developments and modern technological marvels, make sure to subscribe to this and all our Dark Documentaries channels. And don't forget to hit the bell icon to be notified of our newest videos. Stay tuned.